Hey guys, what's going on? And as you can see, we are back with American Truck Sam. And I don't know why, but uh, uh, looks to seem I'm having controller issues here. Uh, hold on a second. Ah, uh, never mind. We're good. Anyway, yeah, uh, we are back, and as you can see here, um, I actually did end up purchasing that truck, that uh, the modded truck that I had put in the game. Uh, I thought it would have been really, really expensive, but uh, surprisingly, uh, whoever modded it, I guess, I don't know, he, 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 it basically replaces like one of the cheaper trucks in the game, so it was pretty cheap. Um, we yeah, after a sweet uh, paint job on it, and I'm really glad I got it actually, because I did have that other truck that you guys saw in my latest video that I just uploaded today actually. And um, it has like 524 cent motor in it, uh, coming, and this one, uh, this one's got a thousand horse, uh, I don't remember what kind of motor in it, but yeah, it's a lot, it's a lot better, it's part of the power and wide, and there's a joke, so. Um, right now, uh, I'm not on a current job, I was just kind of driving around exploring. Yeah, you guys saw, I think, I think this truck was in my first, uh, American Truck Sim, um, video. I almost said review, but I, no, it definitely wasn't a review video, but, <laughs> uh, yeah. You know, um, I'm making this as more of a test, really, because... I noticed that uh, when I would watch uh, um, the last video I uploaded that there was, in a couple scenes of uh, when I was playing this game, uh, there was a couple scenes where the game looked like it lagged real bad, like it, the FPS got real low and it was getting choppy. But I said to myself, I was like, I don't remember that ever happening in the game itself, you know, it, it seemed very odd. Um, so I thought that was very odd. Uh, I did some research on it, and because I thought, well, the game, it wasn't, it had no issues, right? Like, granted, this game doesn't run as well as it should on the hardware that I have, 980 Ti. Um, basically, it's a really, really old engine, and it's not really optimized for this kind of hardware for any newer gen hardware. And um, it's just not very optimized at all. It's more of like, an, I, I don't, I wouldn't say it, it's not an indie game, but it's a, it's a very small dev company. Um, I'm not really sure if they're an indie company or not, but either way, it's the kind, that's the kind of quality you get from the engine. It's not very optimized, so, whereas at some point, you know, it'll only be using like 70% GPU, but it's only getting like 48 FPS at the same time, so there's, you know, plenty of uh, GPU there, it's just not utilizing it properly because of the old engine, basically. Um, so, it wasn't lagging or anything though, right? It never does. It never has slowed down or anything. But in the video, there was a couple parts where it looked like it was, like it did in the video. Uh, upon further inspection, because I was told to use OPS, I was actually using XSplit um, to do this in the beginning. That was what the first uh, video that I recorded you saw was on, was on XSplit, I think. Or maybe it was the built-in... Uh, I'm on Windows 10, so maybe it was the built-in Windows 10 screenshot recorder thingy. Um, but either way, I thought that was really odd. So I did some research, and apparently it's OBS, because, like, it's not, it's not my setting. The settings are where they should be. They're not high or anything like that. I have plenty of CPU. Um, I have, I'm only using 50% of the CPU right now. I have a 6-core i7, 5930K, running at 4.2, so it's not the CPU. There's plenty of overhead, plenty of resources. Uh, there's nothing running um, on the machine that would spike the usage uh, here and there. I keep my machine super, super, super clean. I'm very, 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 very anal about um, keeping it super clean and making sure there's really nothing running, eating resources unless I tell it to. So it wasn't anything like that. I have, um, you know, it wasn't, it wasn't, um, it wasn't any Windows services either because I have prefetch and all that crap turned off. So it wasn't anything hitting hitting the hard drive or anything like that. Um, but upon further inspection, like I said, when I did research, I did find out that it was OBS. I'm just letting you guys know that, you know, that's not an excuse. It, 
really is, and a lot of other people have said they have the same thing, where they'll they'll have no lag in the game whatsoever, but then when they play back the video, they see a couple spots where there was like it looked like the game was lagging really badly, but it wasn't for them. Um, oh yes, the man, the admins on their uh, forums they actually claim that it's not a bug in the software, and that it's because you don't have it set up properly. I think they're full of shit because. Maybe for the other people that was the case, but for me, you know, it's only re it's recording in 2560 uh, by 1440, um, which is not too high for the hardware that I have whatsoever. Um, I mean, everything that I'm doing, I'm j I'm using the super fast preset, so I'm not trying to do it, you know, like on a, on a really on like a really high end preset or anything like that. All the settings are stock except for. Um, uh, except for the resolution, and uh, that's about it. And, and a few other things I tweaked that, that that you're supposed to tweak to make the experience better. But it's not, it, it, you know, it's, like I said, the admins claim the they work for the company. Obviously, they claim that it's on the software, but it definitely is. They're blaming everyone's hardware. I'm like, that's bullshit. I mean, you know, I have 50 percent, 50 percent free on the CPU. And it, I'm using the X uh, X264 codec uh, to uh, or encoder to encode everything, meaning that it's actually using CPU power and not GPU power to to uh, to um, uh, encode the stream or not. Well, you know, the stream file the file stream, and um, so it's so it's not using GPU for that. And I, I'm usually running around while playing this game, doing everything. I'm usually got about 70% uh, GP between 60 and 70. So, yeah, it's nothing like that at all. I, 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 so, if you guys basically what I'm trying to say is, if you guys know of any better software than OBS that's not going to cause issues like that, even when you have the appropriate hardware and the appropriate settings set up, because the admin's full of shit. It is a bunch of software um, where it may not be for everybody. It definitely is my case. Um, I've made sure of that, you know. Um, I, I know for a fact that it is. So if anyone knows of any software that's just easy to use in OBS with all the features and everything but doesn't have that issue, uh, please let me know. And I'm using OBS Classic, by the way. I'm not using the, uh, the new one, which I will try, and hopefully they've remedied that issue. Um, they know that it's their software, but they also, they don't want to, you know, they don't, all companies are always like that, they're always like, oh, it's not us, it must be this, or it must be that, you know, even when they know, even when they're aware of it, they just can't come to admit it, they never can, um, I will try the new, the new OBS once, but I've heard that it's really buggy right now, because it's a beta, so, once it, once they fully release it, I'll definitely give that a shot. And it's sad too because I really like OBS. It's uh, by I've tried two two other programs to do this. And by far, this is you know this is the best one by far, definitely. So aside from that little issue, um, I did but, but I did use this to live stream once, and I had that one setting. What's it called? E. So um, it's like three letters or whatever, and you have to you have to check that box in order to live stream with this software. And then I also had the frame interval on four because to stream to YouTube it wants the frame interval on four, so I changed that back to one and I unchecked that box. So hopefully that's what was causing the um, the issues here and there. It only happens like once or twice, you know, in like an hour long video. So hopefully the what I did remedies it because um, it's definitely on the software end. Yeah, if you guys ever experienced anything like what I was explaining, let me know. Just you know, tell me down in the comments. I'd be interested to uh, to read about that. Yeah, I'm just driving around exploring. I'm trying to just. I don't know. I should probably take a job here. Let's see. Uh, I don't really need to though, because my employees are just pulling in money. So. See, look, uh, he just pulled in like eight and a half grand. I think, I think my garage is full. I think I need to buy another one because I can't find that button where you're like able to, uh, um, to buy more slots for more trucks and employees. And I think it's gone because of the fact that it's full. I'm not totally sure on that though, but I'm pretty sure. Um, I don't know where to buy other garages or anything either. 
so that's kind of confusing. I don't think I found. I, I've pretty much been everywhere on the map for the most part, like probably seventy percent. Uh, so I'm not sure how to do that either. Get out the way, ho. Oh, dude, move! Jesus Christ. The physics are very basic. Let me see something here, guys. Um. Yeah, check this out. I've never taken out a load in this game, not once. See? Otherwise, I'd be logged over it right here. Nope. I did it the slow way, but I'm telling you, it's a lot better that way. If you have the patience. It, was, it really wasn't that bad, actually. I think it was worse than, worse than uh, the European trucks in two that the American trucks in. Let me see, guys, if I can... Uh, Yeah, see, there's no, like, usually there's a, uh, yeah, yeah, I know all that. Usually, like, there's a button over here where you can, like, upgrade. You see, there's two slots down here. But if I go to, um, hold on, let me turn this off. Wait. See, there's two empty slots. But if I go down here... Um, click on hire driver, so you don't have any slots available for your driver, please upgrade one of your drivers to buy a new one. See, that's the issue I'm having. Uh, yeah, I don't know, guys. Crap, no, I didn't, I didn't want to do that. Try this again. Uh, where, I don't, I don't know how to buy a new one. Plus, I think, I don't need to, I just need to, um... I think maybe it is cool, but then I don't know why it shows two slots down there. But I don't see, I don't remember where the upgrade button, but it was like somewhere around here. Quick travel to the garage, I guess. Let me try this. No, it's the same menu. Uh, I don't know.
I want to buy every one one of these trucks because like way more horsepower. Some of these are upgraded. See, two of these have the 520s and better transmissions. Um, two of them don't. I want to just go ahead and get them all upgraded to this with like a different, all with like one paint style that's different than mine so I can differentiate them from, from each other uh, if I ever need to swap them out or something. But um, yeah, they would, if, if all my crew had these, they, they would do much, much better. Um, actually, let's do that now. Uh, where do we do sell it, or... Uh, well, before I do that, I want to... Well, yeah, I guess I'll go ahead and do that. Yeah, this is going to be pricey, man, but it, it's going to be worth it to get, um, I, I do, however, want to, um, upgrade the transmission. Okay, I didn't realize it was going to be this expensive, honestly. Um, I probably should have traded them in, but I didn't know how. Uh, purchase again. At least I don't have to pick it and customize it every single time. That's actually a nice touch. drain me but it'll be worth it man because I have they'll be able to get around a lot quicker be able to get their stuff there and back faster uh, the only thing is though is that they're well the gas tanks huge so that's good but it's gonna cost me more money on gas so I would imagine because look this is a truck well no wait no they didn't have that but sort of like that they had a basic truck I don't remember what the size of the gas tank was, but it wasn't very big. Actually, let's look here. Um, here it is. 237, and then if you compare that to like 700 whatever it was, so yeah, that's a big difference. So the gas is going to cost me more money now, but um, I think it'll be worth it in the long run. I still can't figure out how to upgrade, though. I don't know how to get other, uh, I don't know. Um, go ahead and save. Yeah, I'm not sure guys, if you guys have any idea on how to get to that upgrade button for the garage, like, let me know. I know this, this is just for the trucks. Oh, that might be cool. But yeah, let me know, guys. Because at this point, I honestly have no idea. And also, let me know what you guys think of the um, the uh, 
the 3D animal thing on the instead of my face on the thing, it's the animal 3D thing, whatever you want to call it. Um, let me know what you guys think of that. If you think it's better than uh, it just being me or what. I don't know, man. What's the... Maybe it's fully upgraded. I don't know. But then why are there two slots down here? That's what's confusing to me. I guess I'll have to find another... Uh, actually, let, let me look to see if I can't find another... Uh... Yeah, see, I, okay, I've got 63% score. Um... Crap, now I can't, oh, there we go. What does the garage look like? Oh, that's cool. Oh, I can't even Is that? Mm, I'm not sure what I'm looking for as far as like another garage to buy. Mm, like, cause if you look down here, the one I own, it, it just looks like a regular pull-in area with like a gas station, rest stop thing. I'm not sure what I would be looking for as far as like when I'm looking for another one to buy. Let me look that up real quick, guys. See if I can get any info on that. Okay. Yeah, see, the, okay, so the upgrade button is supposed to be... Uh, I see a screenshot. It's upgrade button. If you click, uh, like, here. Um... Uh, no, 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 um, it's supposed to be on the picture, like, right here, so I guess it is upgraded all the way, I was right on that, okay, um, some American cities use for offer empty small garage, to buy it, stop at the green icon, purchase by paying, oh, wow, uh, a hundred and eighty thousand? Holy crap. But it doesn't really give detail, it just says, um, uh, to buy a stop at the green icon and confirm to, hmm. So is that what I'm looking for on the map then? And I'm not so sure I've discovered any. Because I never got a pop-up that I remember seeing anyway that said that I have discovered one. Um, but is but I wonder if that if that would show up on the map, like that green money icon, signaling that there's a shop there. I kind of doubt it. Well, I don't have enough money to buy one now anyway. Uh, but money should come in faster now because I upgraded all their trucks, so that's good. They're pretty much all good to go now. Um, am I still at the... Okay, yeah. 
All right, let's do a job for you guys here. Uh, damn, that's heavy. 34, 41. No, that's not enough cash. Um, yeah, well, I guess we'll do this one. Pick up the uh, trailer. That's not bad at all. Ooh, that was close. Yeah, that's the only thing. The brakes on this truck aren't that great. And you think they would be, considering it's like a way better truck than the other ones like way better uh, but for some reason the brakes just aren't that great and I don't think that's something that you can upgrade I, I don't I'm pretty I don't I think I've, I don't believe I've seen that as an upgrade option which now that I think of it is kind of strange you think that that would be an option See what I mean? The brakes just suck. I mean, they're not that bad, but it's just, it's so strange. Alright. Go we'll get the trailer here. There it is. We're not really trying anyway. Okay. Oh yeah, you can definitely tell it weighs 41,000 pounds. <laughs> but once it gets up a little bit, the structure have no issue with it.
Yeah, I was hitting my mod there, guys. As, as I said in the last video, if I ever veer off into a pole or something, it's because I don't have my uh, hand on the uh, controller that I steer with. So I'm probably hitting my box mod or something. And uh, here's the horn, by the way, guys. And yes, that's mod. <laughs> of course, but uh, yeah, I had to throw. I saw that on the mod uh, website, and I was like, yeah, I gotta put the train horn on it. I mean, it fits this fucking truck perfectly. Oh man, this thing's hauling, especially uh, since it's pulling so much weight, and it hasn't even had that much of a uh, straight road really to even get up speed, and it, it, it has no issues whatsoever. My driver's leveled up, that's good. Probably because they have a way better truck now. <laughs> I don't think your drivers actually drive on the road. You guys want to know? I think it's, um, I think it's, uh, uh, what's the word for that? Um, I think it's simulated uh, by code. I, I think, I don't think they ever go, I don't think your, uh, your, your employees actually drive around in the world. I, I really think that it's just simulated. Which kind of sucks, but I mean, it's probably not like you see them anyway, but it'd still be cool if they were, if it was uh, like in real time and everything, but it's not. Oh, that's okay. Yeah, so uh, if uh, anyone's still watching who's been here since the beginning, um, go ahead and uh, give me a subscribe. I would really appreciate it, guys. It really means a lot to me, and it makes a big difference in the growth of my channel. So yeah, please go ahead and do that. It would it would really help me out a lot. And if you've made it this far, then you know you might as well. You obviously like my content. Um, most of you have probably not made it this far, and I don't blame you.
Yeah, I guess I'll pull into the way station. I don't really want to, but. I guess. Yeah, it's really not a big deal when you, uh, when you at this point, uh, when you're progressing at this point in the game, if you don't stop at the way station, because I think they only deduct, I think it's a hundred, a hundred or a thousand, and that's really not a big deal at this point. I mean, if you got four people driving underneath you, and um, you've got your skills and stuff up, and you're making, you know, twenty, thirty grand a day, then it, it shouldn't be that big of a problem. I'm really hoping that when this is done, I'm going to go back and watch some video footage and hopefully it doesn't have any other issues in there. It's really strange. When I first started using OBS, I didn't have any of those issues that I noticed anyway. Um, and then um, it all started after I streamed with it, the first time I streamed with it, because in order to stream to YouTube, you have to change a couple settings for it to be compatible with the servers and everything. And um, after that is when I started noticing it happening a couple days later after those settings had gotten changed. So I really. I really think this should be good now since I switched them back. We uh, we will see though.
the hell was he slowing down for if he wasn't going to turn? Like he was braking like at like right where he would turn, but he just went straight. That's fucking weird. Excuse me. <laughs> Probably give that dude a fucking heart attack in the truck. It won't kick out of six. Come on. Here we go. It was in 16th gear, guys. It didn't. It didn't more another. Uh, I would. I mean, I let off the gas a couple times, and it wouldn't draw down. I have it on uh, uh, easy automatic, just because it's with the controller. And if it was, I, I like playing with manual in like racing games. But the, since it's a sim, and you know, it's an 18 motor, there's like 16 plus fucking gears. You know. Oh shit, no. Oh man, I can't believe I just missed it. We are going to do something very legal and go up the exit ramp so we can so we don't have to fucking backtrack all that much. Okay, that works. <laughs> Don't mind me, you know, just a giant fucking rig coming through on the wrong side of the fucking road. Nothing to see, nothing to see big. Don't worry about it. Those are speed traps, by the way, for anybody who hasn't played this game. Um, if you if you pass one of those parked uh, pay cars, they uh, and you're going over the speed limit for the area you're in, it'll it'll get you, it'll write you, it'll take you automatically. But I have all that speed stuff turned off. Oh shit. Alright. Ooh, we leveled up. Let's finally, um, uh, let's finish this. Okay. Let's see, how long has this been going on? Stream. Alright. Alright guys, well, this, this, this video has been going on quite a while now, so I'm going to end it here, and uh, I hope you enjoyed yet another uh, American Truck Sim video. Take it easy, and I'll see you in the next one.